Hi, I'm Mike Roder with Review.com. We're here today to talk about the Slingbox 500. So the Slingbox is a piece of technology that actually lets you watch what you normally would watch on your cable box on another device, so on a tablet, on a phone, or on a computer. So the Slingbox is all set up, it's connected to the internet. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can connect to it using this tablet. There's an app for, uh, for Android and for iPhone. Um, interestingly enough, actually, the app itself costs 15 bucks, and the Slingbox that we bought, the 500, is roughly in the $300 range. It seems like it's a little excessive to pay $300 and then another 15 on top of it, um, one of our minor gripes. Uh, so I've got the Sling Player app open on my tablet. Uh, gives you a couple of different options. One of them is connect, so I'm just gonna hit connect here real quick. And uh, what it's doing now is accessing the Slingbox content and using the magic of the internet to bring it to my tablet here. So uh, it looks like we're actually watching local news and I'm nowhere near the actual cable connection. So if you don't wanna pay the $15 for the Slingbox app, you can actually use their free web portal uh, you just go to slingbox.com, put in all your information, and lo and behold, a stream of what you have on your television at home can come to your desk. So say you already have a smartphone, you don't have or don't want a tablet, and you're not interested in using the computer interface. You can pull the app up on your smartphone, have Slingbox run the streaming media to your phone, you can have television literally anywhere you need to go. Let's say you're a college student going to school in a different city and you want to watch you know, your home football team or the team from your state. Well, if your parents have a sling box, you can actually fire up the sling box at home and get home games in your new state. However, this situation does bring up another problem with the sling box. Only one person can use a sling box at a time. So if I'm watching a football game on my tablet and let's say mom and dad are at home and they want to watch Dynasty, all of a sudden it's going to switch from the football game to Dynasty on my tablet. So, you know, if somebody is going to be at home and wanting to use the television as well, maybe it's actually not all that useful. So we have the Slingbox 500. There actually is a Slingbox 350 as well. Really, the only difference between the two is the 500 comes with Wi-Fi and it's double the price. The 500 is $300. The 350 is about 150. We saw it for around that online. A similar device that we tested recently was the Dish Hopper, and that actually is a giant DVR with a Slingbox built in. Um, that's really the best of both worlds. The Slingbox doesn't record shows, it doesn't run apps, it doesn't actually do anything other than shift where you can do your cable. Dish Hopper takes care of all of that and recording. Um, and if you have access to Dish or have the Hopper already, that's definitely the better bargain. 